Welcome everyone. The first step to activate automation in your iPhone is inside of the shortcuts app. You should see the automation option right here. And if you don't, the simple reason why is your software is too old. So this is the older software, iOS 12. And if we go to the shortcuts, there is no automation. In order for automation, the software must be iOS version 13 or newer. So let's go into the automation here. And we have create personal automation, which is an automation, which is going to run on the iPhone. And you have automation for your home accessories. Let's create a personal automation. And you can say, choose these options. So I'm going to have a app here and I'm going to say that when the app store is opened, the automation is going to run. So let's go next here and you can add whatever actions you want. So I'm going to add an action and in here, let's have a look. We're just going to show the weather, right? You can have this to do whatever you want and you can't import automations other people have created, but you can watch videos on YouTube for some automations that you may want to set up yourself. So let's tap on the next option here and ask before running. I would recommend you turn this one off so it just runs and you don't have to you know, start it. And let's tap on done. And so if we go to, let's say the app store, Okay, it's going to show the weather. So this type of automation, I'm not sure if you'd want it because it, <laughs> you can see it just moves the app. So maybe this is not what you'd want, but uh, yeah, this is the general gist. If you go back to the automation area, you're going to notice the create personal automation option is gone. So just tap on the plus and then the old menu is going to show up. To remove an automation, just slide to the left and then delete. With that being said, if you'd like to help support the channel, please do check the description. Bye bye.